making of the country house so first of all i sized everything and started to make the structure of the hut usually i don't prefer joints so i keep everything in intact unless it is really meant to be in two pieces or need. the sturdiness of the structure is really important so i reinforced the base uh, properly so that uh, there was no chance of it wobbling or uh, you know mm. like just misaligning at the stage secondly i was also wanting the house to stand on stand on its own so for that i gave it a you can say a 1 or 2 degree tilt towards the back so that it's easy to move around during the stage show with stage props i think it's really important that you understand the usability and the movement of the prop on the stage so now the structure is standing time for details here i'm cutting out the window panes so i've used honeycomb uh, she board sheets for this if you require these you can dm me and i can help you source these out then now the door so just sizing out the door and eyeballing everything before we actually place it so now i'm adding paint and textures to it yeah so the placement is complete and uh, now i'm using a stanley level to make sure that everything is 90 degree when i start uh, applying things so here i am with sen and we are uh, you know placing all the textured bricks onto the country house perfectly aligned and just leaving out the spaces where we have to fill the door once this was ready we were back to cutting some textured papers for the roof so here i'm cutting the standard fennel patterns and sticking of the roof has been taken care of by my interns painting the door the details on the door have been added by ruhi brilliant brilliant artist who just came around to help us and now finally shipping the country house and installing it in the school and finally it's show time so enjoy the show